Hey Coffee Geeks, it's Tim coming to you again uh, for another episode um, of Coffee Geek TV. Um, today I've just got into Osaka uh, in Japan and uh, as soon as I dropped the bag off to the guest house I've come straight into this, to this place I just quickly read about um, what was it, the guest house through sprudge.com and this place is called um, Takamura Coffee, Wine and Coffee Roasters and I'm upstairs at the moment, it's a fantastic cafe, so it's a really, really feel and laid out. And what I really, really love about this place is it's actually got uh, both of my worlds come together. Um, one being my background in wine, and uh, my second is obviously my new love for coffee. Now, just to give you the quick lowdown of my background on wine is, uh, yeah, I used to work in it, and I used to live near the wine regions when I was living in Australia. Uh, and I used to love drinking it so much before, loving coffee. And since moving to Thailand, it's just unjustifiable, unjustifiably expensive. So I just don't drink as much wine as I used to because the range is not good and the price is obviously not as good as well. So, so obviously that overlap into coffee has come across just with tasting profiles and having a trained palate uh, or continuing to train my palate. And uh, yeah, so like this place is just fantastic. So um, if you're in Osaka, come and check this place out. But let me just give you a quick tour anyway of this place. I'm just going to quickly walk down the stairs here because it's so great. So if you can just bear with me, come and check it out. It's fantastic. So that's Takamura Coffee, uh, Wine and Coffee Roasters. Yeah. So peace out from Tim. Take care.